Now the way this camera is loaded up is that the back opens like this. There's a latch on the side. Now this is an empty cartridge of film that I have. Now if this cartridge was filled, film would be in here. It slides in there. You close down. On this side, you have basically a leader that you need to pull out. Once that leader is pulled out, you're good to go. One thing that I like to carry around with me when I'm going to flea markets, garage sales, this is an empty 669 holder. So I always have one in my car, so I bring it with me because they, again, they still make this film. Actually, Fuji makes this type of film too. I forgot to mention that. And Fuji will continue to make the film. And so when I see a Polaroid camera that maybe I'm not familiar with, I put my cartridge in there. If the cartridge fits, I know that I can essentially make this camera work. Now, just because Polaroid might not make a film for the camera, the camera might be essentially obsolete, they call it. If I can buy a camera for a couple of dollars, I'll still buy it for parts or to put a different lens on a different Polaroid. Or if a camera looks pretty beat up, I'll still buy it because I'm always trying to fix cameras, Polaroid cameras especially. And if you can interchange the parts, you might make a great camera out of two not-so-great cameras.